Ladies and gentlemen, make some noise. He's climbing out of the car. The Winfield Warrior, Mike Marler, deep fried 75 winner. Mike, dominating performance multiple, multiple times. You had a plus four second lead. If not for a caution there with about uh, 20 to go, I don't know that you don't lap the field. Oh, you know, I've I seen some of the guys I started up there with, and I said, I must have a pretty good lead here. But, you know, Dale, man, is so good. And Dale's my hero, man. He's 57 year old, and he's got me running like that every lap. You know, he's, he's tough. So, uh, so when I seen he got the third that fast in the second, I said, I better not be playing around here. So I was on it. So I just assumed he was on me. Maybe he wasn't. I'm not sure. I'm going to let you speak to this race car. I watched you. You could run top. You could run bottom to get through the lap cars. You did whatever you needed to do. You had a, just a, a phenomenal race car. I did, yeah. You know, I got a great team and great cars. My guys has been with me forever. Josh been with me like 17, 18 years. And Donk's been with me like, been with me like eight. And, uh, Cody's helping us now, and uh, you know Ronnie Delk is their tenth year of ownership for Ronnie Delk. So uh, he's given me great cars through the years and all through time, and and uh, always wants me to have the best, you know, whatever the, whatever's available. So can't uh, can't thank him enough, you know, and all these sponsors too. And you know we got Miss Steel Valley and Craig Lindsay and Petroff Towing and uh, you know Delk Equipment, just you know VP Fuels, Bill Stein, Hoosier, just all these people. Clements Motors. I never gave Glenn a good enough shout out because. <laughs> Good thing when we think about Glenn, we have no problems. So uh, sorry, Glenn, for all the times we forgot you. But uh, yeah, Duck River's uh, always been an awesome racetrack, and they've come in here. It looks like they got some new blood pumping here, and it looks like they got some. I don't know if it's new ownership or what, but the place looks really nice, and they're working hard at it. And you know, us racers appreciate that. So nice, uh, nice to acknowledge that. Anybody else you want to thank for for your uh, performance tonight? Well, I just kind of think you know, Craig Lindsay. You know, is a big sport of mine. Craig and his family. The home of Lars back in Iowa. That's. 157 North, a race shop up there. We use a lot of times when we're traveling, and uh, like I say, uh, I'd like to give a big, big shout out to shout out to Capital Graphics, uh, Paulson Stussy, uh, Vern Paulson. He's hope he's watching tonight. So got a lot of great sponsors. My wife Stacy's always with me. And the biggest, the biggest, you know, uh, credit I could give anybody though is this crew. You know, they they live in that rig, and we tr we race all the time. You know, three or four nights a week, and uh, couldn't just it's an awesome life to live, and couldn't do it without those people. All right, Mike, congratulations. Yeah, thank you. Ladies and gentlemen, one more time for your race winner here in Sublimited Victory Lane, the Winfield Warrior out of Winfield, Tennessee, Mike Marler. Dale, normally I like to talk uh, to the second place driver and say, ah, you know, you could have got up there, but uh, it was Mike's world tonight. I think we were all just living in, uh, living in it, but you had a heck of a, a car and a good race there for second multiple times. We did. We just we missed a little bit uh, in qualifying and, and got us buried and, or got us on the outside of the heat race, but Mike had a better car. so. Uh, we just need to work and get balanced a little bit. A little bit rigid through the holes, and he can float through those holes and carry speed better than I could. So uh, uh, it gives us something to work towards. So uh, it's, it's a good night. I need to think easy go and clots, Comatic, uh, Northeastern Fabrication, s &H Systems, uh, my Cleveland guys, uh, Campbell Insulation, MS Motors, uh, just everybody, uh, BlackRock on the front there, Benedum and them, and just everybody that it, it takes to go up and down the road. And Shane, Sarah, and Landon. Uh, for making the journey over here, and, and uh, great to see this, this these stands packed tonight. And uh, so, thank you guys, race fans, most of all, for coming out and supporting us. Appreciate you guys. Dale, congratulations there on your second place run. Appreciate you racing with us. Oh, no problem. I, I really enjoyed it, and enjoy this little place creates some excitement, you know. And so, I was hoping to get. I, I kept getting beat on the restarts, you know, and I was, I was hoping to get up there and race with Mike. Yes, the only shot I had was to get, get him pinned up in lap traffic or something, because. On, on his flat out run, he just had a better race car. So uh, congrats to them and, and uh, you know, and, and we'll, we'll shoot at it again. All right, that is your second place finisher, Dale McDowell from Sublimited Victory Lane. We'll walk just right over here. Uh, Jaden Frame, uh, Jaden, uh, you and Dale had a great race. Uh, that'd been a great race for the, for the lead there if, uh, if it wasn't for the 157 checking out and almost lapping the field. Yeah, he checked out and left us all. But, uh, uh, you know, third place, I'll take it. Uh, running between these boys. You know, I grew up watching these guys, and I, I, I just love being on the front stretch with these. You know, it's just a privilege. So, uh, I'll take third. Yeah, you, you touched on it, and that leads into my next question. What does it mean for you to race here in front of a, a hometown crowd for you to race with a Dirt Lake Model Hall of Famer, Dale McDowell, and then Mike Marler? Yeah, it's just awesome. You never know, uh, never thought that you'd be able to race with these guys here and me be on the podium with them. So I'm just blessed to be here. I'd like to thank good Lord for everything. Uh, even give me the chance to race and do what we love. Got a lot of sponsors and crew behind that you want to thank? Yeah, just my parents, uh, my mother, my father, my papa, my nanny. This, everything goes into this. Joe Demby, uh, Danny Bradford, Russell Barnett Kia, 
uh, Cody Ballard, uh, all my crew. Just everybody has a has something goes into this. Well, how cool is it to look up in those grandstands and see this massive of a crowd and then that pit area packed like it was? Yeah, it's just awesome, especially with the rain chance we had last night. So just luckily we got it in.